New cities are emerging in Enugu and people are gradually moving towards these new cities and new locations. All you need to do is just to reach out to us and we'll begin a process to help you on how you can be part of this great city. edition of our weekly updates this is a, a platform where we bring updates to you to help you understand what um, we are doing at Graceland Estate to help you understand um, the level of works to bring a consistent knowledge and information that will help you to to make decisions when it comes to you being part of the project that we are developing at Graceland Estate so today um, what I want to do quickly is to I hope you understand um, why Graceland Estate is situated where it is today. And when we talk about location in real estate projects or real estate investments, there's always um, basic things one always look out for that informs his or her buying decision. And that has to do with the major infrastructures that is within um, access of this particular location. So today, Graceland Estate is actually um, one of the best uh, estates that is coming up in the city of Enugu. When I said I'm talking about coming up, I'm talking about an estate that is actually um, undergoing uh, a serious process of infrastructure. Because I know that most of the things you have seen around when it comes to estate development is uh, people come in, um, they do a little works and the estate is sold off and without any physical uh, infrastructures um, on the side of the developers. But today, um, one beautiful thing about Graceland Estate is that there is never a day that you visit Graceland Estate that you will not see um, workers on ground. So work is ongoing 24 hours. So today we want to talk about the basic infrastructures that we are bringing into Graceland Estate. I want to talk about the, the basic landmarks Okay, that surround Westland Estate. And I believe that at the end of this discussion, this will help you to make a decision, okay, if you have not actually keyed it into this project. So today, we want to talk about Westland Estate and the basic infrastructures we are bringing into Westland Estate. Westland Estate, um, as, as we all know, is going to be um, a residential estate where people that are looking for um, affordable, affordable homes can key in and assess. Uh, assess uh, a service slots where they can build their homes or can as well buy an already built house. Okay, so whichever options you want to go for, I uh, will be rest assured that you will um, achieve that or have access to that in Graceland Lake State. So in Graceland Lake State, we have um, strategic infrastructural developments that we are bringing in just to make sure that every single person that is living in the estate enjoys the full services that we are bringing on board in terms of provisions of infrastructure. First of all, um, coming to the roads, Graceland Estate is going to enjoy a massive, massive and um, good road network, well tagged, both internal and external. When I talk about internal, I'm talking about internal roads within the exit and we talk about external roads. If you have actually visited Graceland Estate, you understand that the roads in front of Graceland Extent, leading towards the Enugu Abakarike Expressway that is just about 1.7 kilometers, it's actually under construction, okay, from the inside out. Okay, so the construction has actually begun. Okay, if you have visited the extent, you notice that the construction started from the inside out. So what it means is that while we are taking care of the external roads that leads to the extent, we are equally taking care of the internal road within the extent. So Graceland Extent as, as it is today, um, we have concluded the drainage construction of the first um, section of the exits. Drainages has been completed, well taken care of, so we are moving in straight into uh, Etwork. So what that means is that in no distant time, that entire internal roads in the exit will be taken care of. Okay, the Etwork, once you complete the Etwork, then asphalt and every other thing. And once you drive into Graceland Exit, you can navigate around all the um, roads in the exit 
What it means is that you can drive straight into your own plot if you have actually secured a plot in Graceland Estate. So outside the road, um, the first plot, immediately after the entrance of the estate by the left-hand side, is actually reserved for a situation room and a control unit. In Graceland Estate, we are making provisions to make sure that the entire estate is covered uh, with CCTV cameras. Both the street lights, the fence, and everything will be covered with uh, security cameras. From the situation room or control unit, um, the, the, the security personnel that will man that particular facility will always know what and what is going on at every point in time within all the axes of the exit. If there is any situation in the exit, one can easily respond swiftly to uh, remedy such situation. Then secondly, we are equally uh, bringing in a, a, a full street lights into the exit. Street light, all the roads in the exit will be will be having a, a street light. So what that means is that the nightlife in the exit will actually be something you will love to experience. The outside the street light, we are equally bringing in um, water. We'll make sure that the water uh, it's made available in the entire estate. So we are probably bringing in electricity. There is a quality provision for the 3 kV electricity line that will be uh, supplying the electricity to the estate. So, um, and every other facilities that you can think of, there is a, a gardens and landscaping in the estate. There is a quality a love garden, like I said, in the estate. There is a provision for a school. If you are living in Graceland Estate, you don't have, uh, you don't need to start uh, thinking of how you can start. Um, shuttling for school run every morning and afternoon. That is a provision for school in the exit. So if you have younger ones that will have need for school services, you just enroll them in the estate school. Okay? They do probably have a provision for a recreation center, a mini stadium, where one can always leverage on for their sports activities or probably a mini event as it concerns the people living in the exit. There's equally a provision for a hospital. Okay, and that is actually very, very strategic because we know that from time to time there is always a health um, um, situations that do come up from time to time. So if you are living inside Graceland Estates and there is a health complications, probably at the middle of the night, you don't need to start uh, thinking of the nearest hospital within the town to, to rush to. All you need to do is just to come out from your, from your house and move straight down into um, the Estate uh, Clinic. So that actually will help you to at least remedy whatever health situation that, um, that will be coming up from time to time, probably before, um, if it's a, a situation or complications that will require other referrals to other higher uh, hospitals. At least for the basic thing is you, you get access to uh, health services first hand in the state before you start thinking of elsewhere. Then there's a point provision for shopping plaza. There is a provision for exit uh, chapel. Okay, so every single thing you need to leave in Graceland Estate, it's actually considered and are being provided. So um, these are the basic infrastructures uh, that we are bringing in Graceland Estate. And as we speak, just like I said, this is not like a promises that we we have seen. Um, around we promise you do this we promise you do that at the end of the day you cannot see even in the single world and we have seen massive massive infrastructure works already on ground that is a testimony that is a testimony and a fact to prove that whatever single infrastructures we are pro we are promising to provide that we are going to provide them okay so the drainages has been completed we are moving into health work as we speak so just the rest are short before the end of one year or one year and six months you will see a tremendous and remarkable changes in Graceland Estate. and this is just to encourage you if you are not part of this project yet do well to get a plot in Graceland Estate. and this is the best time to get a plot in Graceland Estate because currently the value of Graceland Estate when it comes to the plots and the estate it's nine million naira. Okay, and the beautiful aspect of this is either you pay this one off or you can leverage on our flexible payment plans to achieve this. All you need to do is to make an initial deposit of at least two million naira and spread the balance for three months. Okay, if you cannot do three months, there is equally provisions for six months plan and twelve months plans as the case may be. So 
um, there are beautiful uh, landmarks that surround Westland Extent that makes it strategic for anyone that is thinking of living in Enugu. Okay, we have Akanobiam International Airport just about four to five minutes drive away from the exit. We probably have a Coast City University that is about two minutes drive away from the exit. Just a narrow triangle here, it's about approximately four minutes drive. So, it's actually at the heart of the enemy, okay? And it's in a serene and beautiful environment, away from the noisiness of the town or noisiness of the city. So, this is just to encourage you if you have not been part of this awesome project that is going on in Westland Next State, this is to let you understand that new cities are emerging in Enugu and people are gradually moving towards these new cities and new locations. All you need to do is just to reach out to us and we'll begin a process to help you on how you can be part of this great city. So, I, I know you have questions, I know you have uh, probably concerns or things you need to know and all. all you need to do is uh, reach out to us through the numbers on the screen, okay, or probably connect to us through um, any of our, our realtors around. You can always um, get your questions answered and we look forward to hear from you. So, um, we'll end here for today and I look forward to coming your way next time with other amazing, amazing information. Thank you so much and do have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.